Hello everybody and uh, thanks for stopping by and checking out Hard Mod Systems. My name is George. I want to thank you for taking a moment and learning about my channel a little bit. Um, why am I starting one? Well, um, a lot of people will tell you uh, I'm a hardware addict. I love computers. I love working on computers. I love talking about computers. I love playing games on computers. And uh, it's something I've always done as part of my life. Um, as far as gaming goes, I started when I was uh, around 10 years old when my father and mother bought me a ColecoVision. Um, I played that thing to death. Uh, my brother uh, found an old Atari in the back of a destroyed car, basically, and... Uh, we managed to get it working and I played that to death. Um, I suffer from dyslexia uh, and it was really hard for me to do school reports so my father insisted that uh, our family get a computer. So I was one of the first kids in my area where I grew up that got a computer. Um, a Tandy 1000 SX with dual five and a quarter drives uh 256 k of memory and uh man i cut my teeth on that thing um i played sop with camel um gunship pirates uh, i played that thing to death uh i was huge into sub sims uh silent service uh the hunt for red october um just gamed hard right from the very beginning as soon as I had the opportunity and at the age of uh, 52 I still game um, favorite games right now would be uh, Valheim uh, I love popping in on that um, and playing it um, mostly hang out and construct things um, but I do enjoy some good uh, multiplayer servers and uh, I've had some of the most amazing adventures just trying to get a cart down a mountainside um, Red Dead Redemption 2, I've started playing that again lately. Uh, GTA 5, I've been popping in on that again lately. Um, Warhammer Inquisitor, uh, I picked that up a little bit late, uh, just recently, but I'm really enjoying that. So, uh, computers and gaming have been a big part of my life. Um, that being said, you would think after 30 plus years of gaming, Actually, that's closer to 40 plus years of gaming. Uh, I'd be good at it, and I'll be the first to admit I suck. You could put me on a square map with two boxes and tell me what to do, and I'll still get lost somewhere in between the two boxes. Um, it's just one of those things where I get so excited, uh, especially playing in multiplayer games, that... Uh, I make a lot of mistakes just out of nerves and uh, excitement. So, um, yeah, that's me in a nutshell with gaming. Uh, computers, um, like I said, I had one when I was very young. Uh, and each generation came out, um, we would upgrade and get better and better and better systems. And uh, in my uh, early 20s, I actually worked for a computer retail store. Um, I did that for a few years and you know, it was probably one of my most favorite jobs I've ever had. The uh, chance to get to talk about something you love and enjoy and share it with other people and uh, build the excitement in them as well as assist them in making their purchase was uh, a really rewarding experience and it's something I wish I'd stayed with but uh, different things in life led me to make a, a choice for changing and uh, my occupation and uh, that came to an end but ever since then I, I keep dipping my toe into the computer business ideas and things um, I have built so many computers for friends and family uh, I, I have built them to sell them, but I, I didn't like the uh, dealing with warranty and uh, tech support. Um, 
I'll stand by the comment that some people should just not be allowed to own a computer. Um, <laughs> so it could be a very frustrating experience at times. Uh, so I've shied away from opening a computer store. Um, but as far as dealing with people that I know and uh, helping them and building things for them, it's it's a different story. Um, maybe it's because I have more patience because they're family and friends or um, I weed out the ones that shouldn't own a computer. Um, why am I doing this now? Why am I doing starting a channel so late in life? Um, it's something I've wanted to do for a very long time. It's something I've thought a lot about. Um, am I completely prepared to do it now? I don't think so. Um, but the excitement and uh, the encouragement that my partner and her daughter have given me over the last few months has, has I guess, built up the courage within me to finally take a stab at doing something that I've wanted to do for a long time. So I want to thank them. Um, life's thrown a few curveballs, uh, which have stopped me. Um, but, you know, everybody has those things. And sooner or later, you either jump into it or you uh, possibly sit back and regret not doing it for the rest of your life. So it's just time to do it. Um, it's time to just jump in with both feet I've got the time I've got the uh, resources right now um, to make it happen um, so right now I'm kind of sitting in front of a green screen and that's because the space I'm going to be using is in my basement and it's it's got a workbench and shelving and, and fairly decent lighting but it's rough um, if you watch the coming soon trailer that I did previously you will see it's open joists in the ceiling. Um, it's not very well organized. There's a stack of two by fours because I want to build a second bench. Um, and I also haven't installed the necessary hardware to really get rolling with it. Um, I've been learning a little bit at my general computer that I use all the time. Um, and now that I've kind of played a little bit with uh, streaming on Twitch and shooting videos for YouTube, um, it's just uh, time to really sink my teeth into it and uh, give it uh, the tools and the time that it takes to start building something. Um, yeah, there's a lot of things that I'd like to do and uh, I'm looking forward to sharing it with other people. Um, that's the biggest thing. Uh, it's always nice to have a hobby and uh, be able to do these things, but it's just that much more special when you can share it with others. And uh, I'd like to invite all of you, or anybody, to uh, subscribe to Hard Mod Systems, to uh, throw us a like if you like it, and uh, comment, good or bad, uh, you know. It's a learning experience and uh, it's going to take help from people that know better than myself to teach me and educate me in this new venture. So with that, I want to thank you all for taking the time to watch this and uh, I look forward to seeing you in the future. So take care and thanks again for watching Hardware Mods or Hard Mod Systems uh, with George.